breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. It is happening and everybody is wondering. APC called out by Atiku over long-standing transparency, oversight, insecurity, and much more. As Atiku asked Tinubu, where is your promise to Nigerians? Nigerians are dying. A lot of things are going wrong. People are being captured all to insecurity. What is the government doing in order to secure lives and property? What exactly is going on as Nigerians begin to wonder to themselves? Please remember that Nigeria belongs to all of us. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Halaji Atiku Abubaka, the presidential candidate of the People Democratic Party in the 2023 election, has levied accusation against the government of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu, citing negligence through its transparency concerns. The allegations arose in respect to the unresolved 3.3 billion NMPCL loan repayment scandal, expressing his view through a post on X platform. Alaji Atiku Abubaka highlighted the conspiracy silence surrounding the NNPCL loan as it, in, as, it in, as it indicts Tinubu, his family, of systematic corruption within the Tinubu's administration. He emphasized the administration's disregard to, for due process in public governance and transparency. The current federal government Atiku asserts has a deployable history of overlooking transparency and due process being followed in public administration. He pointed out to the lingering 3.3 billion NNPC loan repayment controversies, which has ballooned to 12 billion repayment ob obligations for Nigeria as a country to pay. Atiku urged the Tinubu's administration to address such high profile corruption cases, transparency, and ensure that Nigerians know the truth. He called upon the National Assembly as the elected representative of the people to fulfill their constitutional mandate of legislating for the nation's peace and order and good governance without any form of hindrance and exposing all form of corruption. Tinubu should lead and live by example. He failed to do what is needful. Is covering lies. Atiku cautioned the government would only further implicate itself in official, in official matters, and so the truth must be said. He urged Nigerians to ask Tinubu to tell Nigerians the truth what, of what is going on in his administration, from the Senate to the House of Representatives to the presidency. Is all braided and is all braided and covered in lies. Tinubu must tell Nigerians exactly what is going on and stop lying to the people. We want to understand what is happening. Atiku calls for transparency, saying it is about time we begin to do what is needed, what is truthful. Enough of the lies. Tell Nigerians the truth. The cover up is enough, and that's all that needs to be done. We need to know exactly what's happening right now. So, my lovely people, we need to understand it that, uh, you know, Nigeria is moving forward and want to get the truth, okay? And uh, right now, we are tired of the same thing over and over again, okay? So, it's, it's about time that um, we see things for what they really are and begin to do, you know, the whole honest truth and ensure that at the end of the day, things are done decently and in order. There is just a lot of lies going on, a lot of cover-ups. And if we want to understand what is happening, it's about time. Okay, so nobody should sit back there and, and pretend that, you know, everybody just keep quiet and allow things to continue, you know, just the way they feel. So this is what is happening right now. This is what is going on. This is what is going on. Atiku has accused, you know, Tinubu, you know, of not, of not rising up and doing all that is needed, all the needful. He says, you know, Tinubu is not transparent. The NNPC loan and all that is going on. There's been a lot of lies and a lot of things going on. And everybody's watching to understand, you know, what the matter really is at the moment.
you know so this is you know this is what is happening this is what is going on you know so my people don't forget that you know we must tell ourselves the truth and understand you know everything that is happening okay and know exactly what the truth is so please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news nobody should you know lie to each other you know none of us should continue to lie to ourselves okay Atiku, in fact when he was there was not better himself these are all political talks and everybody knows exactly what the truth is at the moment so we want to know you know what's going on we want to know what's happening okay we want to know what's happening so it it is a very very serious mat matter to ensure that you know we we know exactly what you know how these things are playing out atiku is just saying what he's saying you know we're not we're not supporting tinubu we're not supporting tinubu in any way they all know exactly what they are doing they are all the same thing they all know exactly what they are doing okay they all know exactly what they are doing so don't think that it's a strange matter they all know exactly what they are doing tinubu himself is 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 not a saint they are all the same people they are all the same people. They are just lying to us, you know. And that's why we need honest, sincere people who will be who will be honest to open up, who are transparent and really want this country to move forward. You see, so don't forget that Nigeria, for Nigeria to move forward, okay, we need to we need to get to the very bottom of this. We need to ensure that those who are honest and sincere really do get to the very very you know really gets to leadership position there is just too much lies going on nigerians have suffered a great deal you know people come and tell us they want to be our leaders they come make off certain kinds of promises at the end of the day it all ends in fertility they are doing nothing the lies are all over the place you know and everybody's wondering everybody's wondering so it is a very very serious one and we cannot afford to be silent and quiet in the face of everything that is happening we want this country to move forward we want nigeria to be a better place and we want things to to get better okay so it is it is it is a very very serious matter please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe please click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news god bless have a fantastic and a lovely day and from us is bye for now bye bye